Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing fabulous this fine day. I'm currently filming this on Friday, so I'll be uploading it Sunday, so happy Sunday. So today's video, you probably saw from the title, but we are going to do an unboxing. So freaking excited, do I have my switch here? No, I've actually filmed the footage of unboxing already. I filmed it on Christmas day, because I was too excited to wait to unbox it. But what I'll do is I'm gonna run that footage next, and we're gonna go through the unboxing, and then afterwards I'm gonna give you a slight review, and also what games I'm playing at the moment. So very excited, very excited. Let's get into this unboxing of the OLED Switch. I'm obsessed with it, just so you know. So let's go. It's actually Christmas day when I'm filming this because I want to do an unboxing of my OLED Switch. Very exciting. All I gotta say, this is a gift from me to me. So completely purchased it for myself as a Christmas gift. So let's get into it. I've been wanting to open this for so long. So let's go. So this is what it looks like. So this is the OLED switch. I currently have my switch light. This is what I currently have. So it's a big upgrade. I was like, you know what? Let's treat yourself. Let's get the new one. And of course I got the white one. So let's do this. It's gonna be super hard to do this without moving the camera. But here we go. Wow, ooh, so this is what we're looking at. Pretty freaking cool, isn't it? We have all the little the Joy Cons. How awesome, okay. Joy Cons first, ooh, they feel nice. That's one. This is the other one, white. Ooh, they feel cool. They feel really cool. It's weird having them like not on my switch and like in my hand. <laughs> I'm so excited. Oh, I've been I've been waiting for this for so long. Okay, next up we have the actual switch itself. I think it's upside down. Wow. How beautiful is that? So this actually, um, your man in the shop put on a screen protector. I don't think you'll be able to see it, but there is a screen protector on it. So your man in the shop put that on, but he kind of put it on a bit dodgy. So one corner is like sticking out, but it's fine. But the great thing about this well, it's the new switch. So the back stand, it comes like, it's all the way. It's not just a tiny little stick. So it's very exciting. So let's add these in. Satisfying. This one goes in here. Ooh, oh my gosh, it's massive. It feels like, you know what, it's a lot heavier. Mm. Yeah, it's heavier than my light, but it's much bigger. Like, let's just do a comparison before we go any further. So these are the two, the two different, like, how insane. I'm used to this, obviously, but this is so cool. Oh my God, it's like, I'm scared. I don't want to break it. <laughs> um, okay, so that's all that was in this part. There seems to be instructions. Nintendo Switch, Nintendo Switch, and that's important information. Uh, yeah, nothing really interesting in this, so let's put that back in there. But next up, so, we have the plug itself, which is the same as the other one, so now I have two. And that can go in the bottom of it. Cool, great, it's just a normal plug with the USB-C port. And then we have, this is HDMI. So this is so I can play it on the TV. Yeah, it's a double HDMI lead. So this is so when I plug it in, I can play it on my TV, which is a major reason why I got the OLED switch, like with the switch light. With this, you can't actually play it on your TV. So this, it'll be really exciting to be able to play games on my TV. So that's that. And then we also have this, so this came with it. This is like a, it's like a little control, oh, that's backwards. It's like a little controller. Look at that. So if we take these off, so if we go click, there's a button on the back. One, come on, two. And then you can actually put them in here. So here's the other one, two. So you can actually use it as a little kind of remote instead of having just holding them separately. It's a little like a remote so you can go about your business, you know? So that's kind of cool. Kind of a weird shape, but it's actually kind of cool. And then we also have, oh, these are, oh, so these are actually uh, straps for the Joy-Con. So let's put one on. So yeah, so it's a strap. So you can either just have them on your wrist like this and that's kind of handy that they come together actually, isn't it? super handy and um, so I obviously got two of them this is the other one 
just put that back in there because I'd say I'm not going to use these if I'm being realistic. So that's that. And then lastly, in the box, so there's actually nothing else in there, uh, we have the docking station. So this is what it looks like. It comes in this. Wow. Ooh, look, it's white. It's kind of cool. Oh, I really like it. It's like a matte white. And then the back. I don't know how you open this. You just pull it out. Oh, oh, you just pull it out. And in there, in here, is where you put all like the leads and stuff. So that's where the HDMI will go in, etc. And then go onto my TV. So yeah, that's everything I got in the box. Obviously super freaking excited. Let's put these back on. Accessories wise, I didn't go mad. Obviously I said already I got the screen protector, which is already on it. So sorry about that, I couldn't show you that. But I did get this bag on Amazon. So you would have seen this in my previous video. <laughs> video. Uh, you would have seen that I got this bag. I didn't open it though, so I just kind of briefly showed you because it arrived the day I was filming. But yeah, so let's open it and suss it out. Lovely, nice big size. Ooh, it's so soft. Look at it. Of course, it's Animal Crossing themed, if you didn't already guess. <laughs> but yeah, it's actually really... Oh. It's like a little lunch bag. So there's obviously a pocket on the front. Um, but when you open it, so instead of it opening like fully, it's just one that you kind of slide in. So there's also a strap for it. Big long strap that you can actually like put around your neck or whatever. Um, but inside, so if you see inside, there's space for your games. There's also kind of pockets in here and this actually moves over. So there's more space there. So this it's pretty big to be fair. So then this will go in here, I suppose. Yink. Oh, fits perfectly. And I can also put like all this in here as well if I want to. Now, pretty chunky. Fit, it fits a lot. Like it has the switch, it has the remote control thing. Pretty decent to be fair. <laughs> Woohoo. Um, okay, so that was probably the quickest unboxing you've ever watched. But what I'm going to do now is I'm actually going to trans set this up and transfer over my Animal Crossing Island and I'll catch up with you pretty soon. Welcome back. So I hope you enjoyed that unboxing. I wanted to give you a close up of the switch right now so this is it currently let me just plunk this on so this is what it looks like and um, there these are the little joy cons it's kind of hard to see joy con another joy con these are my main games um i play animal crossing 24 7 and uh, well i used but it's my most played game um, I got this one recently, which is actually discontinued. This was limited edition. It's the Super Mario 3 All-Star. So it has Super Mario Galaxy and then these two other ones. I can't exactly remember what they are. But the reason I got it was for the Super Mario Galaxy because I played Super Mario Galaxy on the Wii and it was freaking fantastic. Um, I got Zelda Breath of Wild because I heard it's meant to be amazing. Um, so these two are new. Got them when I got the new Switch. So then the games I had already were Super Mario Brothers and mario kart which you can't see because it's not focusing so super mario Bros. and mario kart and then this was actually used to transfer my island from animal crossing so i oops i was able to transfer my island over from my switch light to my to the switch so thank god i'm actually currently making a little cafe because it's so far just in case you're wondering but yeah so that is the switch um little review so far i'm obsessed with it um obviously it was a big upgrade going from the switch light to the oled so i'm super excited i made the upgrade because first of all it's just beautiful like it's just insane and um, the white is gorgeous the stand is so helpful and um, the screen itself as well is just miles better than the switch light and the fact that it's an oled screen as well just makes everything better i don't actually play it like this a lot because i find it quite big i always kind of take up take off the joy cons and just stand then the screen like take these off and then just kind of stand the screen on my desk normally and then I have these in my hands and I'm like, play, play, play. But yeah, so really happy with this purchase. I suppose, do I recommend it? I definitely do, um, especially if you've been using a Switch. I also played this on the telly and oh my God, everything's just so much bigger. Even when I played it for the first time on this, it was just so much bigger and I was like, wow, like insane. I absolutely love it. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. I know this video might've been a bit all over the place, but it's fine. We get there. But yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next week's video Sunday and goodbye. I hope you have a lovely weekend. Bye.